Hi Scorpio, this is your weekly day by day tarot cards reading by M for the week starting 2nd of November 2020. It's going to be two cards per day every day of this week. Right, so on day the 2nd of November, and we have the moon. And then the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, by the way, I have to tell you, last week we did have this uh, Knight of Wands in every single reading. Now the moon is going everywhere. Just by the way. <laughs> now Wednesday, Temperance. Thursday, the world. All majors, eh? The Magician. Hermit. Is it really going to be all made? <laughs> Someday. The three of Pentacles, not all made. <laughs> but six out of seven, and yes, death. You're influencing energy. Something is over. It's over. Transforming, it seems, your life. Scorpio is transforming big time big in a big way this is lots of majors okay i'm not gonna even talk for the until i pull um, second row ace of pentacles the wheel of fortune tuesday four of swords with wheel of fortune temperance wednesday with the tower the tower I did have on Wednesday with Leo and with Libra. Queen of Wands with the world. The magician. The magician Friday with six of wands. Now that's beautiful. The hermit. The hermit with nine of swords and three of pentacles. Three of pentacles with Queen of Pentacles. Nice, nice. The Emperor. Scorpio, um, this is big, big. All right, your life is gonna change in a major way and you are feeling it, you know it. You are bringing different structure in your life. You want it. You wanna change your life. I mean, after the situation that is over in your environment, and it seems it's not going to be only one aspect. It's going to be affected. Many aspects of your life will be affected with this change, with this transformation. Something really major. You are changing your life in a massive way. New foundation there completely. New structure for your life. Something like that. That sort of influencing energy that you have in here you know, pulling it into this week. With Ace of Pentacles, there is opportunity for you that comes. You are aware of it. Opportunity is there. But the moon, you are not exactly, you, you don't see exactly details about this opportunity, but you are not missing it. You, know, you won't miss this opportunity. This is within you. You are seeing it clearly. You are prepared. You are preparing yourself for that what comes your way and it's a big opportunity big pentacles in here something that is related to your career to your money to your business definitely seeing it through and big preparation is there still ongoing on monday you are preparing for it bill of fortune and four of swords New things are coming here, new elements, new facts, new situations. Things are changing with Wheel of Fortune, new cycle in, in these things, in this business. New cycle in, in the same business or something, you know, a very new business or a new career or new situation in your, in your private life. But it is new with Wheel of Fortune. Change is there. Four of Swords, kind of, you are not, you don't know what you think of it. I mean, you've got this moon and you are preparing for something that's supposed to bring you money, supposed to bring your career. But now this change, this what is changing, this situation is changing on Tuesday. Something new appears in here and you don't know what to make of it. You are kind of not even sure is it good for you. 
maybe some situation that was hurtful that is changing now and it's just you still need time to heal but it's no more hurtful situation difficult situation that kind of choose they could be for you that you get uh, growing over uh, growing out of these difficulties need some time to heal to see things clearly what is that new for you you still need clarity you still need to heal but the new things new dawn new day something else is the change of cycle for you is there and i really think that you are over these difficulties three of swords are standing there you know and it says with time you'll heal and it is time has come for you to heal to move on Tuesday. Now, the tower, it, it seems to me it's going to be your decision. Your decision. Look at you've got <laughs> you've got Wheel of Fortune and you do have tower after it. Now from now on you've got this major energy and it, it's not bad. Look, your tower is within you, and it's these two are, are kind of almost exactly the same, like Wheel of Fortune itself. It is that you that you want to um, break down some something that was that was in your reality, some situation that is you see it doesn't serve you anymore. That you are there, kind of um, pushing it. Uh, you kind of you did put dynamite underneath this building, this uh, this tower. You don't want to be known, to be said, perhaps, that you are breaking down this relationship or this situation, but it serves you not to be there anymore. You seeing your success, your future much better than that what you have right now. You were building it, it's all right, it seems fine for the time being, but something new, something more prosperous is coming and somehow you want this, you want this situation to go away. You want it to disappear and you're pushing it out of your way. Um, must sound a bit manipulative, might, might look a bit manipulative. That's what you're trying to avoid. You want this stuff to look, you want it to look like, like um, this situation doesn't have future anymore. You just want it to look like that. But uh, with all honesty, you are pushing for it. Temperance says, you're gonna wait. It's all about you. You are pushing this wheel of fortune. You you feel that situation is changing. Something new is there. And you are pushing this wheel of fortune. You are pressing hard for it. Pressing hard for that. Temperance, you know, and perfectly know that is gonna be lots of dust, lots of rubbles here and you will need to wait for this dust, for this dust to settle. Something will be around this situation that is breaking down and you are ready to balance it, to wait until everything is accepted and understood, until it's clear for you to move on with something new very major, very major. It, it seems that you are breaking down on something that is ongoing. Something is ongoing, but something better is coming and you're just discarding it. You just discard that, that ongoing things. It wasn't, it wasn't maybe even bad, but you are discarding it. It's not for you. You've got better. As I said, you have to wait for dust to settle before you move on. The world and Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands in your energy, Scorpio, is lovely energy. This is energy of Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. This, this energy is jolly, intuitive, visionary. You see your future. You've got ideas about your future. And you're not mistaken with this energy. This is knowing it and moving towards it happily. Happily, what needs to be done, it will be done. What needs to be understood, it will be understood. With joy, happily and with joy. The world closing down in this, 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 this time of your life is finished. Something else, something new is different and you are looking forward to it. With joy, with happiness, with enthusiasm. New life, new time. I'm telling you, something major is happening this week. Major, major. 
the magician on Friday with a six of wands. How better could it get um, on Friday? Winning path, winning path, and you are riding with this magician. Look, being visible, being um, this is promotion, visibility, success, winning card, the best winning card, winning energy in our old deck, six of wands. You are riding on your winning path. That's what you know. From now on, you will be successful. There's no doubt you, are, you found your way for success. Six of wands. Be the magician seeing this future like from now on diamonds are gonna rain on you look this magician energy feeling like you're unstoppable from now on there is nothing that is lacking here you've got your money you've got your success and it, whatever situation that comes up whatever situation that you are dealing with you are dealing with is everything is easy for, for you from now on your career your uh, private life everything everything with this magician like feeling like superior being in here on friday that's lovely lovely this friday is major kind of the whole transformation happened already and on friday you feel yourself there's no way back it's only way forward and it's fantastic very very nice very beautiful now this saturday after all of it, we do have this Hermit energy and Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords is your fear. It could be projected fears. We do have some difficulties here. Some difficulties. Some situation is difficult for you. Requires wisdom, requires tolerance, understandings, methodical work. You see what I'm saying? And, and kind of you are not prepared for these difficulties. Things are just too good for you around you this week. And of course you fear, what if you lose it? What if I cannot manage? Somehow, for some reason, for some reason, you are fearing on this day. And this difficult, that, this difficult situation that appears in front of you, you will solve, of course, you will solve that. You will solve this problem. You will climb this mountain. But you will be fearful. You will be fearful. That's fear. That's nightmare. Not again. Must I do that now? Is it this problem? But you will You will sort it out. You will sort this out. Whatever difficulties that were they. Now three of pentacles. Queen of pentacles. Now we're talking something that you do. This is practical work. You are doing it. You are enjoying it. Feeling really good about yourself. You are planning your work. You are planning your budget. But everything is under control. Everything is under control. And it's, it's smooth ride um, with this queen of pentacles. In a practical sense. No turbulence, you are enjoying that practical side of maybe all of it. Practical side is here. But for you, as I said, it's just a smooth ride with Queen of Pentacles and Three of Pentacles. By all means, this is joyful energy, doing things that are new, that are visible, that are skillful, you know, and you enjoy you doing it and you're enjoying it and people are looking at you, admiring your work. That kind of Three of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles with you is confidence, very confident. You know what you're doing. You know that you're going to be successful and you know that people are going to like it. It's just lovely. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Scorpio, this is, to me, unbelievable amount of majors that I haven't seen for a really long time. And you got it now. Your life is changing and for so much better. I mean, it, it seems it wasn't bad. Like you are changing situation that wasn't bad into something superb. Tower moment. You will push for this tower to fall. Something you will try to break. Maybe there is some promise. Maybe there is something that you have to do. Because a crown is falling um, off the head of this of this tower careful don't embarrass yourself temperance is there i'm sure you're gonna be careful but yeah friday is is absolute success enjoy it